Hi, I'm Fred and welcome to Word of Life. Today is a special day because today we are celebrating our moms. Happy Mother's Day. We pray that your day is filled with lots of fun and lots of love. And tonight after our evening service, as we continue to celebrate moms, join us in the courtyard and enjoy a special time of great music and fellowship. We hope you all can come back tonight. Here are some other events coming up at church. The Youth Encounter for Junior High and High School students will be happening this Friday, May 13th through Sunday, May 15th. If you have not attended one yet, now is the time. At an encounter, you will experience God's unconditional love for you and be encouraged to know that your life has a purpose. You can register at the Life Source Bookstore and today is also the last day to register. Special guest ministers Harry and Cheryl Salem will be with us on Sunday, May 22nd. Cheryl is a former Miss America and now ministers powerfully through the word and song. Harry has a heart to reach men and ministers strongly on overcoming issues in life. Together, after facing a tragic family situation, God began to use them to minister hope and restoration to other families in grief. They are an unstoppable couple through their powerful ministry. Come and expect God to do miracles in your life. What does this box have to do with breaking through? Pastor Art has a special message that he personally wants to share with you that involves this box, your life, and your breakthrough. Don't miss this significant and powerful time next Sunday, May 15th at our 6 p.m. service. It's time to take the limits off of our lives and start living beyond the box. Don't miss all the great things happening at church. Simply subscribe to our bulletin and you will automatically receive it in your inbox every Sunday. Go to wordoflifehawaii.com to subscribe. Once again, happy Mother's Day and enjoy today's service. Oh my gosh, okay, my mom has really delivered. Well, she delivered me number one. That was really important. When I was five years old, we moved on Halloween day. The next day she said, I'm gonna take you out trick-or-treating. Well, my mom grew up you know, watching baseball and she says, don't hold it like this. She says, you know, go with the seams like this and don't do this, come down and snap. So I cut my hair myself and I basically ended up with a mullet. Throw it again, throw it again. Who is this person? It's my mom. Bless her sweet heart, let me borrow the car to travel from city to city to city to audition for the real world. A, B, C. She'd give me advice on how to sing. She'd be like, you have to emote. Okay, you have to emote, you have to feel the song. You have to feel it. You have to close your eyes when you feel the song. Like, I thought that I was giving myself bangs, but there was just like, ooh. And we went door to door and knocked on everybody's door and said, trick or treat. No one's got any candy or any real patience for this sort of thing. So I did get $5 and uh, a box of Hamburger Helper, I think. And uh, I'm so thankful that I didn't make it on, but I'm so incredibly grateful that she let me follow my dream. You are, my mommy taught me that my ABCs. I love my mom this much. My mom taught me to disregard the calendar and just do what feels right. Hence, white pants before Memorial Day. She kind of just rescued it. It was a rescue mission for hair. My curveball will never be good as my mom's, but it was good enough to get me a college scholarship. Thanks, Mom. Thank you. I love you, Mama. Happy Mother's Day. Aloha, Word of Life family. And happy Mother's Day to our entire Word of Life Christian Center family. We thank you, moms, on this special Mother's Day for your sacrifice, for your love. We celebrate you today. You know, moms are very, very special, as Pastor Kuna is to our family. Uh, she's really made us, shaped us, and with her love and sacrifice and surrender, it's made a huge life and destiny difference. And I want to say that as I reflect back on my mom and the sacrifices she's also made for my life. And uh, this is a very memorable day. And I think mom should be celebrated more than just one day. Every day, absolutely. Absolutely, actually. and I'm hearing the cheer yeah. right now from Woo! everybody in the crowd. Yes. Hey. Anyways, well, I wanted to say that this is really an important day. Yes, and so is. we want to celebrate all of you moms, grandmothers, and mothers-to-be on this very, very significant Mother's Day celebration. You're truly a gift to your family and to us here at Word of Life. You're a gift 
to be celebrated today and I really hear from the echoes of the heart of heaven, well done, well done. Your children rise and call you blessed. So from our hearts to yours, happy Mother's Day. We love you very much. Aloha.